Hey, welcome back. It is 7.05. Just left the YMCA. And I think what I'm going to do this morning is uh, I'm going to stop by Home Depot and Lowe's and check out their check out their ratchet straps um, just to see what kind of quality it is. Um, I saw, pro, I, saw uh, I was watching Pro Hall's on his, uh, his latest video where he threw out all of his equipment. So um, and a couple of the straps he got, he said he got from Home Depot. So, and I was, I've been walking through there from time to time and I've seen straps. So, uh, I'm gonna go in there and check it out and see like what the quality is, how much they cost. See, I think they have changed too. So anyway, I'm about to, road, I'm about to ride over to Home Depot and then probably hit Lowe's also and just see what I can walk into a store and just buy right off the shelf. All right, let's go. All right, so I just came from uh, Home Depot. I picked up one ratchet strap, but I think it was like 16 bucks. <sighs> yeah, so ratchet strap. It's a uh, oof. It's two by twenty-seven, heavy duty. It actually says, uh, "You got that uh, official uh, right there." Wait, where is it? Heavy, not to be confused. Heavy duty. So. Flat hook, uh, 30, 3,333 pound working load. Says it's ideal for securing heavy loads and cargo. All marketing. Yeah, I mean, it looks legit though. Like I said, this is the one, uh, if I'm not, if I'm not mistaken, this is the one that, uh, that, uh, over on Pro Hall TV on his channel, these are the ones he picked up. I mean, I've never used them before, uh, at least not in this capacity. Back in the days, Home Depot strapping down lumber, but that was forever ago. So, um, yeah. Uh, instructions and everything. So, what I'm going to do is grab, uh, I'm going to keep this one, put this to the side. Now, I'm going to roll over to Lowe's right around the corner and see what they have. And. I could, uh, could do some kind of comparison. I'll just take them both eventually. Uh, once I get going, I'm out on the road. 
and then I'll get to see like which one actually is better or worse or because I'm going to order some online also so it'll be like a I'll be able to do like a side by side comparison I have zero I have no clue if it even matters where you get them from don't know uh, but find out soon enough so over to Lowe's So, just came out on, on Lowe's. Uh, two inch ratchet straps. Two by 27. Two by 27. Um, smart. Mm, uh, smart straps. Uh, it was so. I actually had trouble finding the straps in there. I had to ask one of the, one of the associates. So it ended up being for this strap, seventeen ninety eight. So we'll call it eighteen dollars. And compared to Home Depot's. $15.98, so two dollars more at Lowe's. Uh, we got this is a Home Depot's. I mean, I, I never used either one of these specifically, uh, but I mean, number one, this comes with better packaging. It's it's. It's, it looks it looks better if I'm just looking at them like judging a book by by its cover. Uh, it just the Home Depot one just seems more legit. I don't know if that will actually translate into performance. I mean, it just painted. It just seems just even just get that out the way. So like even the handle just looks just more the handle looks a little bit more comfortable I mean the side this one does look a little bit wider I don't know if that get, will give it more leverage it's definitely bigger at the bottom like the Home Depot one if you can see in there it's a little it's pretty thin compared to well maybe not it's it's not it doesn't seem as wide um I don't know it's hard to Plus this one, I can't really see all of the gearing 
in the home in the uh, Home Depot one. This one I can see pretty much everything. I mean, it was I don't know. Only time will tell. I can tell one thing right away is that this hook, this part right here, is way it's definitely noticeably wider. So let me show it. You see, I can do this so that you can see. So Home Depots, and then you look at Lowe's. So like it's it's definitely wider. You can see that. Yeah, so just the angle of that bend is just a little tighter on the Home Depot one. So just looking at a bunch of load securement videos and techniques of how guys are wrapping their when they're, when they're, how they're wrapping their straps and hooks and when they're securing their loads. It seems like the thinner or them not being as wide would be better. I don't know. Never did it, so I, only time will tell. But if I had to buy all of my straps right now from either one of those two places, I'm going at Home Depot just because they're two bucks cheaper. They seem to be the same quality, if not better, just at face value. Um, they just look better. So mm, that would be my, uh, that's my initial impressions of comparing the two. But I guess the good news is that push comes to shove, there's Home Depots and Lowe's everywhere. So um, can always get two inch straps. I didn't, I didn't see any three inch or four inch in there. Um, at least not the ratchet parts. I did see some of the actual straps, I think, at Home Depot. But uh, I didn't do too much research on that. So anyway, there you have it. You can go get straps um, from either place. Anybody out there that that's actually working with them, like I said, I know Pro Hall's using, Pro Hall TVC's is using the, uh, the Home Depot ones. Anybody else out there have any experience with those straps versus like the ones you get at like My T products? or uh, I think it's US cargo control, like one of the, you know, the major, the places that most people go. Any, if anybody got any, any experience using any other ones, um, feel free to share. All right, well, that's it for now. Thanks for watching, bye. A little bit of a bonus, a little bonus chapter here is uh, stopped over at the Harbor Freight because they were open. Went to check them out. Um, nothing, um, as you could see, there's really, um, I shouldn't say nothing. They had, they didn't have any, um, they didn't have any straps with flat hooks. 
Uh, they did have binders. They did have um, they they had the uh, what do you call it? Oh, they had moving blankets. So, um, but no no uh, no straps with flat hooks in there. So anyway, what I did get. This thing. This is one of those things in Harbor Freight that every time I go in there, like I keep looking at it, and it, um, I'm like, oh, I'm gonna get it, I'm gonna get it. Lights jacked up. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I'm gonna look out. Oh, that's kind of cool. Um, but I never get it. So today it happens, and I got a couple other things just because you can't get out of Harbor Freight without spinning anything so anyway so that does it for today i guess I'll check you out in the next video thanks for watching peace